Ariel, there are 12 different fire departments here. We are seeing firsthand just how serious and how intense this fire is. I just spoke with several firefighters and fire chiefs here who tell me this is actually a five alarm fire and they are expecting it for it to be a six alarm fire at the end of the night tonight. They say it'll take about five to six more hours for them to contain these flames. This is all happening in a hardwood facility with several other excavators and machinery in this lot. There's oil on the ground. I thought at first when we were walking around that it was just water, but we've been told several we've been told several times at this point to back away for our own safety. I can tell you this is serious. There are several several towns here responding to this fire. We've seen the Exeter Fire Department, the Epping Fire Department, the Chester Fire Department. Of course, there are police here. I also spoke with people who are here who work for Eversource who say they were called to this fire to this scene here to turn the power off in this lot. We know that there are also snow plowing machinery here. I'm told that there have been no injuries reported so far. Fire chiefs tell me that so far they are still investigating the exact cause of this fire. But again, they are saying it'll take about five to six more hours to contain these flames. And what you're seeing right now on your screen is actually much tamer than when we first arrived at about 4.30, 5.30, excuse me, this afternoon. We are seeing several first responders. There are several crews here from 12 different towns, like I said. Of course, police also say they are still investigating the cause of this fire again. There have been no injuries reported. We will follow up with the fire departments who are here tonight on the cause of this fire as they continue their investigation. But for live, we're now, for now we're live in Epping. Imani Fleming, WMUR News 9.